Hi friends, I'm Mrs. Ragini. Today I want to share a recipe with all you know kinds of dals and little bit of rice and this I make it in winter every time. So let's start how to make this very very simple soup. So for this soup what we need is all kinds of dals. Whichever dal is available with you, you can just use it. So today I'm using some urad dal, some tuar dal and some moong dal and some chana dal and very little of rice and some pepper for some spiciness and some cumin seeds and you know you can just use some cloves and cardamom for some more of spiciness so we are using horse gram and we are just going to dry roast first all these ingredients and then we are going to cook it in a very slow flame for at least 10 whistles because we want our you know dal and rice to be fully mashed so let's start the dry roasting process. So first we are going to add some urad dal and some tuar dal, moong dal and chana dal and also horse gram and rice for spiciness, some pepper and some cumin seeds and in the last because I have just used very little quantity I am just using some two cardamom and some three cloves so this I am going to roast it in a very slow slow flame so friends I have slowly roasted it for you know five minutes very slowly because I don't want the ingredients to burn and what you can do is this ingredients you can just dry roast it and keep it in the refrigerator and you know whenever you feel like having a nice soup then you can just remove these ingredients put some water and pressure cook it for 10 or you know depending upon how much consistency you are making you can just cook it in a pressure cooker and then you can make this nice simple soup so here this is all done now we are going to add enough water to cook this Dear friends, we did not add oil, ghee, butter, nothing. This is very, very simple and you are going to see next what I am going to do. And in this we are going to add the salt. So this we are going to cook it for 10 whistles. So we are going to wait for another 5 minutes. So dear friends, after you know 8 whistles, I have just switched off the flame and the cooker has also cooled down. See, this has cooked so perfectly. This is nicely mashed here only. But still, we don't want any of the ingredients to be seen because soups are like that. So, what I am going to do is, if you want, you can cool down this and then you can blend it in a mixer or, you know, if you have a hand blender, you can just hand blend it. That's it. And what I am going to do is, I am just going to transfer it into a jar. We are going to make it into a nice fine paste out of this so difference here I blended see this is nice fine paste this is little bit thick so what we can just dilute because this is a soup you can just dilute with some water and this we are just going to simmer it you know just for a minute and then switch off and you can just have this nice all mixed dal soup you can just you know in the same uh, cooker what you can do with the hand blender you can mash it and add some water and just get it to one simmer and switch off the flame and serve it hot hot so you can do either way this way or you know the other way so whichever way if you want you can just do it you can just adjust the consistency depending upon how much you know thickness or thin you want you can just add some water and now we are going to check the taste Mm, this is so so nice yeah I think I can just add very very little of salt because soups you know it should not be too much of salty because we cannot have so just very little of salt in the last you can just pour some cream on top of it or you can just top it off with some cheese and have it this will be like awesome so this has come to a boil I'll just switch off the flame just one boil is good enough and this is perfect consistency see not too thick not thin so now just serve in my soup bowl 
in the last I said you can just you know put some cream little bit on top of it if you want you can have it but today I'm just I want to have it with nice cheese so I'm just you know just little bit of cheese it, this will melt automatically so don't worry that's it so friends our nice healthy soup is all ready just you know be careful soups are always hot hot so be careful and mm. this is so so yummy and nice light this is very 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 simple to make it and healthy also dear friends this you can feed it to kids also but you know don't add the garam masala just add simple spices and you can feed your kids also so isn't it very very nice and healthy recipe so dear friends i hope you like this nice simple healthy recipe with all dals so see you in another session with some more recipes for you